In the quiet corners of America where the hustle and bustle of city life fades into the background, lie small towns that harbor secrets far darker than their serene landscapes suggest. These are places where evil has taken root, thriving in the shadows of ordinary life. Welcome to the countdown of the top 10 small American towns hiding pure evil. At number 10 we have Stull, Kansas. Unassuming at first glance, Stull is a town that has been long associated with tales of the supernatural. It's said to house one of the seven gateways to hell. Numerous accounts of unexplained phenomena and eerie sightings have added to its sinister reputation over the years. Stull, Kansas, a town where the devil himself supposedly holds court. On to number 9, Point Pleasant, West Virginia. Known for the infamous Mothman sightings in the late 1960s, Point Pleasant has become a beacon for those intrigued by the paranormal. The town's Silver Bridge collapse, which claimed 46 lives, is often linked to the Mothman's ominous presence, making Point Pleasant a town shrouded in mystery and fear. At number 8, we find Amityville, New York. This once peaceful suburban town is forever stained by the infamous Amityville horror. The DeFeo family murders and the subsequent paranormal experiences of the Lutz family turned this small town into a symbol of terror, a place where evil echoes through the walls of its homes. Sliding into number 7 is Fall River, Massachusetts. This town is the birthplace of the notorious Lizzie Borden who allegedly killed her parents with an axe in the late 1900s. The Borden house, now a bed and breakfast, serves as a chilling reminder of the town's bloody past. At number 6 we have Savannah, Georgia. Known as America's most haunted city, Savannah is a hotbed of ghostly activity. Its history is marked by bloody battles, devastating fires and deadly yellow fever epidemics all of which have contributed to its reputation as a dwelling place for restless spirits. Moving to number 5, we find Villisca, Iowa. The scene of the unsolved Villisca axe murders of 1912, this town is a chilling testament to the darkness that can lurk in the most unsuspecting of places. The murder house remains a popular destination for ghost hunters and mystery enthusiasts alike. At number 4, we have Salem, Massachusetts. Known for the Salem witch trials in the late 17th century, Salem's legacy is one of superstition, fear, and persecution. The town's history is a grim reminder of the devastating effects of mass hysteria and unfounded accusations. Number 3 brings us to Centralia, Pennsylvania. An underground coal mine fire has been burning beneath this town since 1962, causing the evacuation of most of its residents. Centralia is now a near ghost town, its empty streets and smoke-filled air painting a picture of a place forsaken by time and human intervention. At number 2 we have Dudleytown, Connecticut. Often referred to as the Village of the Damned, Dudleytown is said to be cursed, with numerous accounts of unexplained disappearances, mental illness, and death plaguing its history. The town is now abandoned and entry is strictly prohibited, adding to its aura of mystery and foreboding. Finally at number 1 we have New Orleans, Louisiana. While not a small town, the city's French Quarter is infamous for its dark past, filled with tales of voodoo, vampires, and ghosts. The city's blend of cultures, tragic history, and supernatural lore make it a potent breeding ground for tales of pure evil. And there you have it, the top 10 small American towns hiding pure evil. Each with its own unique story, these places stand as chilling reminders of the darkness that can reside in the most unsuspecting corners of the world. So the next time you're planning a quiet getaway, you might want to think twice about your destination.